Science is fun. We learn cool things every day. Today, we will learn about melting and freezing. Yum! Luke loves to eat ice blocks. He likes lemonade ice blocks the best. Luke wants to make his own ice blocks so he can eat them all the time. He asked Susie the scientist for help. Susie, how can I make my own ice blocks? He asked. We need to go to the kitchen, said Susie. If you make your own ice blocks at home, make sure you ask an adult to help. Susie got everything they needed. We put the lemonade into this ice block tray, she said. And then we put the sticks in, she added. What do we do now? asked Luke. We put them in the freezer so they can freeze, said Susie. What does freeze mean? Luke asked. When something freezes, it changes from a liquid to a solid, Susie said. A liquid is soft and runny. A solid is hard and rigid. Freezing is a physical change in matter. No new substances are formed in physical changes. Later that day, Luke and Susie were eating their ice blocks. Yum! Eat it fast, said Susie, before it melts. What does melt mean? asked Luke. Asking questions, like Luke does, is a great way to learn about science at school and at home. When something melts, said Susie, it changes from a solid to a liquid. A solid is hard and rigid. A liquid is soft and runny. I think I understand, said Luke. If we cool down a liquid, it can freeze. If we heat up a solid, it can melt. Yes, said Susie. That's right. I am going to eat this all up before it melts, said Luke. Wow! Melting and freezing are cool, and so is science.